Hello friends and welcome to another video. It is Saturday. I don't know what the date is. Let me look. June 20th. Wow. Okay. Time is flying, but I am three weeks out. Um, and I just finished up my fasted cardio. So I'm at the gym. Um, but I wanted to vlog today because it is a very exciting day. So last vlog, um, I kind of talked about depleting. Um, so this is six days later. Um, or I've been depleting for six days. I think I filmed on my second day of depletion. So I've been depleting for a total of six days. Um, and, and today we get a big refeed because we are sufficiently flat. I'm going to insert my, um, like a physique update of this morning. Usually a lot of people ask what flat means and it means that my muscles are not full of glycogen. So what depleting is, is depleting all of your glycogen stores. So yeah, it means very, very low food, typically low carb because glycogen is stored carbs in your muscles, right? So <laughs> you're eating very very low carb um and my carbs were got even lower than what i showed you in my last vlog doing a lot of cardio um just to really really get depleted so then you can fill out um so we're kind of just like experimenting since i'm uh three weeks out um just to really really get depleted so then you can fill out um so we're kind of just like experimenting since i'm uh, three weeks out. I want to look full on stage like that is I can't be like super shredded at this show um, But also I look I do like I do not look good like I do not look stage ready today So I just want to be clear about that that this week wasn't like oh Like this is what I want to look like on stage at all now. We're starting that filling out process of like Now we're starting that filling out process um of putting like the carbs and glycogen back in my muscles um, just by eating more, right? So that's kind of the game plan. Um, but yeah, today I have like a big, big refeed. I'm still waiting to hear like details, but more food throughout the day. And then I get like a cheat meal at night. So I just thought I would drag you guys along, um, but just did my cardio um, and I'm training legs later and it will be a good good day so yeah hopefully that made sense um again this is only something that you do if you're like stage lean like peeled if this isn't gonna work in like a lifestyle capacity you shouldn't try to do this unless you have you shouldn't be like doing this stuff unless you have like a coach okay or you're prepping for a show like that's just stupid okay so disclaimer i'm telling you all this and sharing you all this because i am prepping i am three weeks out from a show do not try this, okay? Do not do it. Do not eat what I eat. Do not do what I do because it's not going to work healthy. It's not normal. And it's just not necessary, okay? So, okay, bye. Okay, so meal one, we have a whole egg and egg whites and then cream of rice with a whole egg on top. I did the Pride Foods um, coconut cream pie flavor. So, like, sweet and savory. But um, on my higher days, I do cream of rice instead of oats um, for my first meal just because it digests faster and easier. Um, so we got that going on. And it's obviously a little bit more than um, I normally would have and definitely a lot more than I um, had all week. So very excited about this. Now, um, I'm not putting any like toppings or anything on it because we are starting to track my sodium today so on all my meals like i'm not gonna do condiments or anything which honestly guys i might be more sad about that taken away than i was about like ha having like no food <laughs> this week um like i'm all about my sauces and my like no slash very low cal toppings like that has kept me freaking sane this prep i'm very sad very sad about that but, um, don't be scared of sodium. Sodium is great. Um, I'm still having a lot of sodium. We're not cutting sodium or anything like that, but I just have a quarter teaspoon. 
um, on all of my meals. So that's what I have. I'm gonna eat this. Still very, very excited. Um, and I will see you guys at my next meal. And we have our coffee. I just have um, stevia in it today with, well, with just this coffee. Um, it is so good. I think I showed it in my last video. Um, toasted coconut. I'm obsessed. I've been um, putting hydrate butter toffee in it, and it's so good. But um, this actually does have a lot of sodium because it's electrolytes. Like, it helps with hydration. Um, so... We're not going to do that. Um, stuff that has like very like little bits of sodium, like the Pride Foods, is just like a staple. Like my coach knows that I have it every single day, multiple times a day, whatever. Um, that's like in my diet. Like that stuff's fine. Um, but besides that, I'm not like adding salt to things, if that makes sense. So, um, it's an exciting leaf. Honestly, if you guys know me, you know I love, love having half and half in my coffee. Um, but honestly, this flavor, like, it's fine with just some stevia. Like, you probably don't even need stevia. It's so good. Okay, so about to head to the gym. Um, I have my sweet egg whites, so it's literally just egg white, cinnamon, stevia, and then some salt, and then... More cream of rice. All the cream of rice today. So um, I have some blueberry muffin and then some almond butter. And Will this morning with my check-in, he like gave me my refeed macros yesterday and then he increased them a little bit more. Um, yeah, that's that. I can eat this really quickly because I'm running late. What else is new? But catch you on the flippy. Okay, so... My time, it is post-workout. Um, YouTube time, this is gonna be pre-workout because I'm gonna put just a couple clips of my leg day with Marissa. So enjoy those. I'm walking alone, the streets are empty. The only thing I can see is my own silhouette. I'm getting stronger. Step by step, the clock is ticking, but there's no time for me. I've been flying from town to town, from London to Taiwan. I've been all around the globe trying to protect your soul. We are heroes tonight, we will fly above the sky. We are here. Um, a couple times a week she's really like the only person um, who I'm going to train with maybe like outside of shoulders um, just because like we freaking push each other like we're on the same wavelength when it comes to training I know a couple of videos back I like mentioned training with her and people thought I mispronounced Melissa's name and I was like no Marissa is a different person um, Marissa is my coach's fiance actually um, and she's just like a really, really good friend of mine. Um, and she's a pro. She's prepping right now too. Um, but yeah, we crushed that leg workout. It was literally just four movements. Um, I filmed two of them and then we also did abductors and seated hamstring curl. And then Will just looked at me a little bit because he was there. Um, so that was that. Good vibes, good, good vibes. And now we are home. We're gonna go make meal numero trace. I have another vlog to edit, but besides that, I just wanna chill. Honestly, I'm using today as just like a recharge day. Um, so I'm just gonna hang the post leg -like day. Tiredness has gotten to me, but yo, it is crazy how much of a difference some carbs make, man. Like. I feel like a different freaking human than I did yesterday. Um, but yeah, it was a really good workout.
Gonna go eat. Okay, so next meal, I have jasmine rice. A lot more than I have had, so beautiful. Um, and then cod and then 100 grams of asparagus. And the asparagus, I totally forgot that I had this, but um, I put Mrs. Dash, which is like a sodium free seasoning. It's like not, like obviously I don't choose to use it. It's not my favorite, but it's way better than no seasoning. Um, I guess I could use spices and stuff too. I'm just so used to my, I always put this. But, um, and then I'm just gonna add salt and eat that. I'm um, not adding like lettuce or anything because it's a high day. So, that's that. Catch on Flippy. Update, super, super random, but I totally forgot I have to mail off this, it's a check. I have like a shipping label. I just didn't want to lose the check so I put it in an envelope, but it's too my financial advisor who's back in Chicago <laughs> but it's like to myself to put in my retirement account um my, I have a SEP IRA and if you guys aren't working on your retirement it's worth it um you should well uh, that's just my opinion but um obviously when you're an entrepreneur you don't just like have a retirement account like set up for you so you gotta do that shit yourself <laughs> so I'm making a deposit but I have to like give a check to myself because they can't just put money in there for my account without like my consent so anyways gonna go do that I was editing a vlog and I was like shit I gotta do that before it closes and guys it's a good day it's a good day I'm like it's not that exciting for you guys but I just needed a day to like not have like social obligations and not have like obviously I trained with Marissa but that's like an every week like she's my like my person so you know but um yeah that's what we're doing and then we're gonna go back home and finish editing the last vlog you guys saw found out I can set you guys on my dashboard. I've had this car for like a year now over and uh didn't realize that but update mailed that off treating myself to this is actually oh, all the ice melted because it was hot but I got a iced decaf Americano um and then I just got stevia in it um four packets of stevia because I want I needed it sweet I needed it a little bit sweet afternoon pick me up um obviously it's already hitting hard I don't know the last time I've been like this caffeine sensitive maybe it's just because I'm like uh, now we're gonna go home and get back to it what time is it it's 5 30 already wow Okay, we've just been working, finished editing a vlog. I'm almost done um, working on an email sequence that we're sending out for a free challenge we're doing for Alignment Athletics next week. But um, I just made up meal four. Um, and it's just chicken, jasmine rice, asparagus. I used a different Miss Dash seasoning. Super exciting. This is a chicken one. I actually like it more than the extra spicy one. Um, and then I have some almonds. So, that's that. Probably just gonna keep doing stuff on my computer. Um, and then, it's cheat meal time. Let's go. Um, can I please have two? Char burgers. One, can I have um, wrapped in lettuce? Two char burgers? Yeah. Or cheese or no cheese? Um, no cheese. Right. And, and wrapped in lettuce? One wrapped in lettuce, one normal. And then, could I have uh, three sweet potato fries? Okay, guys. We are back. Goods are secured, you guys saw. Um, so, what I have is I just got a lettuce-wrapped burger, um, because I'm going to use a GF bun. We are prepared. 
Where are they? Oh, they're in the freezer. So. Where are they? <laughs> Silly egg crabs. So I'm just gonna warm one of those up in the microwave. And then I get 150 grams of fries. So, I got myself two um, because I heard that sometimes they're like under portioned. So that's what we got. And uh, Melindy, what do you got? I get a burger today too. Remember, drop a comment when I was on prep and Lex would celebrate my high carb days with me. Oh yeah, always. It's always. Yeah. It is more fun. Okay, so let's do this thing. We did get some extra fries. Okay, and there we have it. The GF bun, the burger, the fries. I know you guys already got the close up, but uh, here we are with the, the ketchup. Here we are with the ketchup. <laughs> guys, we were just talking. I haven't had a sweet potato. And you know how much I love sweet potatoes? Since January. What the? Like, not even a bite. Oh. My. God. So freaking good. It doesn't even need ketchup, bro. Mm. Okay, just gotta do burger. Okay. I'm way more excited about the fries than the burger. <laughs> Here we go. You hit the oh. Spiritual. <laughs> that damn, do I have ketchup on my face? No, I don't see any. Oh, uh -huh. Beautiful! Nailed it. Nailed it. Wow. <laughs> wow! I'm so excited. Yay. Okay, dude, so editing Lexi coming at you here. It's like a week later, and I realized I never closed out this vlog. But hopefully, you guys enjoyed it. Um reliving that day through editing was great um i do want to reiterate that like the purpose of that day was a refeed it's a very acute um like influx of carbs and fat right so i had a lot more food that day um primarily carbs and then i had that burger at night and we ended up really really liking what it did to my physique. Um, I woke up just looking fuller, right? So my muscles were full of glycogen that had been depleted during the week and you look a lot better when that's the case. And I think it's also just a really good reminder for people that like the scale is so relative because um, I honestly don't remember what my weight did after that. But um, when you're depleting, you look like shit, <laughs> but the scale's going down, right? Because all the glycogen's being depleted from your muscles. Um, and it's not all fat, okay? Um, it's, most of it's not fat. Most of it is water and glycogen. And then when you refeed, um, if you're getting fuller, um, and your body's not just plowing through everything, you should be seeing the scale go up and look better. You know, so anyways, that's my little two cents on that. But um, I am now currently, what, 13 days out. Holy moly. Um, and what I think I'm going to do is um, just kind of vlog until my show, just randomly bits and pieces um, and just throw vlogs up as I have time to edit um, because... I do want to kind of do like, keep you guys as in the loop as possible. So I'm going to try to maybe do two vlogs a week instead of just one. Um, but don't take my word for that. But we're getting so close. It's been a long ass journey to the stage, but we are going to get there. It's going to be such a good time. Um, and yeah. Thank you guys so much for watching. As always, comment, share, like, subscribe. Let me know what you guys like. Let me know what you want to see. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.